no 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 Welcome to SJ Scrubs, I'm Saucy Jack, and today we're scrubbing Resident Evil Village. And for the record, you guys know me if you watch this channel. I'm a big bubble blowing baby when it comes to horror games. I think I made it through two episodes of Layers of Fear, uh, and that was during Halloween. So, you know, not my wheelhouse usually, but I feel like there's, uh, you know, a time. In, in my life where I have to make the transition from boy to man. And this is going to be the game to do it. Um, I haven't really watched any videos about it. I, I've watched uh, the intro that comes with this game uh, that gives kind of the story of Resident Evil Biohazard, which is the game before this one, to kind of give some background information on what's going on. Um, but other than that, uh, and a brief playthrough, the very start, just to check sound levels, uh, I haven't touched this thing. So you, you guys are going to all go on a journey with me. Uh, so I'm certainly not going to go hardcore, and I'm certainly not going to go standard, because I'm a filthy casual. And, uh, you know, if you've watched this channel at all, you should know that. So here we go. Village of Shadows. Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. This, this feels very corpse-brightish. The girl recalled Mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Bat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick dark blood and smiled with joy so covid started passing through the graveyard menacing storm clouds loomed and the air turned bitingly cold the girl was shivering in her thin clothes then a dark weaver appeared and with a click of his fingers crafted mist into a beautiful dress come child warm yourself that is a pretty coats. sweet dress so she clothed all things considered and smiled with joy Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Yeah, it's like a paper boat. Then the That's fish fun. king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew you done angry messed up, and eh, some the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. She's reading that to so a baby? In, turn is due. in a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. What? They hey, psychopath. She's asleep. What is with the Having story? She's nightmares to old. last her a lifetime. Woman at the store said it was traditional. <laughs> a local tale. Besides... Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't understand it. Thank God. Hey, no kidding, man. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. You're just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. Oh, man. I'll finish dinner. That's a chonky baby.
It's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember it. I can't blame her. All right. Did you say something? Nothing. No. Nope. Put her down. No, nope, didn't say anything. That's a pretty nice place. Though I gotta say, this guy's this guy's moving like a sack of potatoes. He's like super sluggish. I guess he's not gonna be like running with a baby, but all right. So examine Rose's diapers. Main unit of the baby monitor turned off. Come on, guys. Pretty nice place. I'm not sure about all of these like mix and match rugs though. That's nice hardwood. All right, gonna. Hey, listen. Taking you to bed, kid. There, there. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. After we're done with that one, we're gonna read you it by Stephen King. Okay, what's in here? Ooh, nice tiling. Nice. Uh, where's the kid's bedroom? Got anything over here? Anything over here? Nope. <laughs> I hope this isn't the kid's bedroom. Trying to do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. Yep. Uh, curtain closes on the Dolby gas incident. The committee completed their investigation on the 18th into the Dolby toxic gas leak in Louisiana in 2017. That's talking about uh, Resident Evil Biohazard. They concluded the deaths were caused by a leak of natural gas that had built up in the mud rock under the area. Jack Baker, 57, and his family, who were exposed to the gas, per perished. Ethan Winters and his wife were also believed to have been nearby, but their current whereabouts are unknown. The entire area has been closed up by officials who believe it will be at least 10 years before the area is habitable again. Everyone's forgotten about this already. So the general plot, um, and I mean, there's the the intro video from Biohazard that this game had. Uh, blah, blah, blah. This guy and his wife were in Louisiana. She got infected by some sort of, like, fungus that's somehow tied to Resident Evil lore. And uh, Jack Baker... Uh, and his family were kind of like the, the owners of the house and they were already in, infected there, with the honey. fungus and blah 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 and she received some sort of you know she got better um, and now here we're in somewhere I'm not sure where this is uh, I think the intro video said Europe um, and this is 2020 I think Okay. Get a little monkey action going. Well, hi there, little Rose. <laughs> You're no Frank Oz, sir. Oh, what's that? Gun survivalist, the heavy firearms manual. Okay. Really to get you. Let's try that again. A heavy firearms manual for field combat situation, but combat situation by Joseph Kendo. Those need to not be so fast. I'm not sure if that's something that I can fix in the <laughs> options. Got, got some nice pictures. And pregnancy. Got the baby. Um, more I baby. Stay like this forever. Surprisingly, no pictures of when Mia was infected and like going ham on you and biohazard. February 6, 2021. Mia and I had a, another fight. I accidentally mentioned what happened three years ago, and she blew up at me. We finally settled down in our new life in Europe and can bring Rose up properly, but I still feel like part of me is trapped in that hell hell back in Louisiana. I know Mia doesn't like to talk about it, but can we really just forget everything and pretend it didn't happen? Shouldn't we face what happened there so we can live our lives with Rose without having it hanging over our heads? We owe her that much at least. I know Mia knows this too. She wouldn't have exploded like that at the hospital if she didn't care. Well, all right. Name, Rosemary Winters, date of birth, February 8th, 2020. Height, 
62 centimeters weight 14 and a half pounds she is a chunky baby holy crap that's huge that's like a sumo wrestler baby rose is fine can't keep your mother waiting she's scary when she's angry holy crap and you wouldn't like her when she's angry okay i'm gonna put this kid down there you go sweetheart don't you worry i'll be right downstairs daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you did he just turn the this part of the baby monitor off? Because the downstairs is off. Found that out. Oh, okay, now he's decided to be nimble. That's nice. Okay. And biohazard. Oh, just close. Okay. Uh, where does this go? Oh. Well, right. Is she okay? Sleeping like a, uh, well, like a baby. Hmm. <laughs> that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, Mister. It's Chorba de la Gomez. Was he gonna stick the his hand into the pot of soup? Wow. You've gone full native, haven't you? Mm. Local wine too. What, like, what but did she think he was going to do? All evening, <laughs> maybe you shouldn't have any. You really have to stop worrying. It's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's going to be... Seriously? think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so... <laughs> Oof. She just took that bullet in the shoulder. Like, she's just like, hey, I've been shot. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. What? They did not like your cooking. I can't, I can't move. Mia. Oof. Oh, God. She got godfathered. Chris? What the hell? Sorry, Ethan. No! She's still alive? What? Why? What? What's going on? So that's Chris Redfield. What on earth is happening? Go on, move! Hey, man. <laughs> Rose? What the hell are you I'll doing with my daughter? If I could secure Take him away, sir. <laughs> I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Oof. These subtitles are <clears throat> not synced up. <clears throat> that was like, that was like... Bad kung fu movie. Get him out of here. <laughs> okay, so Mia's dead, and they're taking my kid, and Chris is carrying the baby out, and didn't even have the common courtesy to carry me out. I'm a little put out by that. Hey, Doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I've got your daughter's results back, and I'd like you to come in to talk about that. How about the next day at 4 o'clock? No problem. We'll be there. That was the Doc. She'll see us next week. Hey, now. Think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. Keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan. You matter. You just me. What are you talking about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. I feel like she's not really taking the whole thing. Damn it. Seriously. 
or just like trying to block it out or uh, I'm kind of with Ethan on this one there's the chonk chonker oh okay Jesus. About damn time. What's your status? Is the package safe? What are you talking about? Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not off my Fuck. Hey now. Language, mister. What the hell happened to you? Okay. So, took my kid. Can, can I go in here? No. Uh, okay, examine. Mission objectives. Eliminate target, recover body. Secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. So, eliminate... Eliminate target and recover body. Was that Mia? Because they just load, they just lit her right up. Move the two Winterses, you know, so not three. So I think it is talking about Mia there. Move the two Winterses to Site C for further investigation. At least two transport officers to accompany them. That's so. I think Mia, I I think Mia got got hosed, though. So I'm gonna I'm I'm gonna stop right here. I do want to make mention. They riddled her with like fifty million bullets, and then when Chris walks up to you, Mia starts getting up again. So I feel like there may have been a good reason why they were trying to eliminate Mia. Just first impressions here. It's got like a like a slap bass thing going. I feel like this is like a Seinfeld truck. Okay. Um. He's he's back to walking like a sack of potatoes, but I kind of don't blame him now, since he just got in the car wreck. Uh, this is this is really dark. Um, I, again, as mentioned before, I'm a big bubble-blowing baby, and so, I'll be honest, uh, in the game settings before I started this, I turned the brightness up a little bit more, but even still, this is very dark. Like, there's, I can see very little. I'm not sure how it will come out in the recording, but I can basically see, like, the ground just in front of me. And maybe some trees, and that's it. Okay, barbed wire. Don't touch the barbed wire. Yeah. Idiot. You deserve that. Don't touch barbed wire. Friggin' army crawl through that. Especially... Hmm? Listen. I don't want any trouble. I'm not looking for trouble, but if you want to make trouble, there's going to be trouble. Okay, so there's like growling and dead birds. Okay, so we're obviously behind a Taco Bell right now. I'm not sure the point of hanging all of these up. <laughs> Don't want that. Oh, well, something got it. Uh, 
<laughs> Listen, man. You seriously, if you come at me, you're gonna catch the hands. And I just crawled under barbed wire, so I have tetanus now. I will, I will tetanus you up. So help me. Come on, guys, throw your garbage out. Okay. Oh, there's a door. And a lot of blood. Uh, life tip. If you see a door with a lot of blood leading to it, go in it. So that's where the that's where the secrets are. And by secrets I mean your death. Uh, okay, is there anything to see? Anything to pick up? Open. And dead. Okay. That that seemed very a very dramatic door opening. Okay. So if you look around this place it's filthy. Like, it looks like people haven't lived in here forever. But look at that toothbrush. That's a brand new toothbrush. It is so dark. Mm. I am 100% not a fan of this. Ah, yes, let's go into the basement. Not just into the dilapidated house, but into the basement of the dilapidated house. Okay. <laughs> oh, cripes. That's weird looking. <sighs> okay. Some there it's going to be right behind me. <laughs> okay. I knew it. Frickin' frack knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I'm getting out. I'm getting out. <sighs> Come at me, man. I'm angry now. I'm angry. Come at me. There you go. See, you could have done that under the barbed wire. There you Did his hand just, like, heal? I didn't see the cut from the barbed wire there. Come at me. So help me. I'm gonna headbutt you to death. Oh, and it's light out. Well, that is nice of the game. Thank you. Okay, where... Are, oh. So there's a house in the middle of absolutely nowhere. There's like no, there was a little bridge, but there was like no path, no road. <laughs> Where the frickin' frank heck are we? Environment's very nice. The, the snow particle effects, very nice. Man. What? Where what? the hell am I? I don't. I don't even know what to say. Like, we we so we're in Europe somewhere. I know that, but this is like we got to Disney World somehow, magically.
Okay. Yeah, so windmill. Sleeping Beauty's castle. Just there you go. There you go. Run right over the the uh, broken boards. Get that. Get those splinters. Just uh, you know. Dead horse, dead horses galore. A lot of eggs. Uh, can I go? Okay, so I can go in there. Mm. The question is, do I want to go in here? Out here, it's nice and light. In there, it's not nice and light. It's bad and dark. You got this, Saucy. Come at me. Come at me. Maybe maybe they're out? Yep, maybe they're out. I'm just... okay. So that's steaming. Oof. Somebody has messy eating habits. That doesn't look great. Very little in this looks great. This does not look like a great place to be. Oh, hi! Hey, you know what? Sometimes you just need some glue. What's in here? Come at me. Come at me. Come at, come at me. Come at me. So help me come at me. I'm right here. I've decided that rather than get scared, I'm just gonna get angry. <laughs> What's in here? You up there? You gonna come get me? You gonna you gonna you gonna come at me? Okay. Uh I don't know where to go. Don't enter. They probably should have put that on the barbed wire that I tetanused myself on. What's over here? Nothing. My my neck right now is like so friggin' tense. Okay, that doesn't look great. Uh This is I think uh, yeah, so they drank is that the horse over there? No. At least, well, hey, look, another car. So that's great. At least we're in a place that knows about cars. Though you wouldn't think it, looking around. Oh, I hear a radio. I'll get back to that. I'm going to go down that side path that I saw and get killed. Anybody in here? You gonna come at me? Come at me. Come at me. Right now. So help me. Oh. Monkey? Why is the monkey there? Yep. Come here. Come here. So help me. Oh, there's that symbol again. Very... It's starting to get a very... culty... culty vibe. Open. What if I have to poop? It's inconsiderate. Okay. All right. There's a tractor. Something that. Hmm? And a bunch of goat heads. First birds and now goat heads. Things are going to get bigger and bigger. Soon they'll have full hippopotamuses hanging from the trees. Graveyard, workshop, ceremony site. What? Oh, 
Oh, I thought that was a guy. I, I thought that thing was a guy. Just standing there. Come at me. I'm so ready. That's a lie, but that's what I'm telling myself. Locked due to missing homeowner. Another tractor that's just plowed through everything. What's this? Hey, chicken. At least something's alive. This is this is gonna end poorly. All right, let's do this. Come at me. Come at me. Come at me. Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Where, where you at? Knife! That's right. Blam! Come at me. First aid. Okay, that's great. Tab, open inventory. I got a knife and I got first aid. Okay. Come at me. Mmm. Jeez. Friendly. Friendly. <laughs> Who sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down the road and... What's going on? Oh, no. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? You have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. I got no, two I'm guns. <laughs> Take it. Take it, Take man. It. All right. Are you listening? Didn't like that. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. When I Oh jeez. Dead body? No, that's an alive body. Wait, there's more. Oof. These guys uh Really don't take out their garbage. Okay, still dead. Jesus Christ. Whew. Okay, can you give me back control of my my this place? I wanna look around. <laughs> okay, what there's something moving back there and I'm don't like it. Will you get your friggin' gun out, Ethan? <laughs> okay. Gun. 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 Get your gun out. Get the gun out. Oh, goodness. That was not great. Language, mister. Will you get your friggin' gun out? No. Holy. Blam. Headshot. 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 Will you stay down? What the hell? <sighs> You dead? I hear like... Hmm? I hear like water running. Is that... Family photo. Apparently I'm still great. After getting... Uh, what? Finger and a half? In the chunk of my palm bitten out? So... I mean, kudos to this guy. But weren't there two down there? I, there was one moving in the background and then the one guy bit me. 
Can I not? Can I? Nope. Come at me. Come at me. Don't know what that does. Materials that can be crafted. Oh! So first aid. Med needs chem and herb. Or herb. And gunpowder and rusted scrap for handgun ammo. Come at me. Come at me. What else is here? Oh, there's a herb. And I think I will craft a first aid. Hooray! Okay. Uh, I'm not really sure where to go now. Does this open? If this guy gets back up, I'm gonna friggin' lose my crap. Uh, I don't, I don't know where to go now. Can I, like, nope. What? Is there anything in the pot? No. Did I miss something? In here? Do I go back into the... Like, what do I do here? I don't think I can use the family photo. Um, but I am gonna examine... Well, I can't examine it. I guess I go back in? Can't go that way. Oh, my friggin' frick frack. Bolt cutters! Okay. Examine! Hooray! Whew! Okay. Uh... So you get it. I'm not... I don't like this. Okay, so we gotta... I hear something moving around. I am not a fan, sir. Um, okay, no, no bad guys back there. There's the radio. I'm gonna go around the side. Is that open? And a boot that I hope is empty. Okay, you know what? Here we go. Come at me. Come at me. Come at me. Come at me. Nope. 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 Chem fluid. Yeah! Nope! Get out of here. Get the frickin' frack. Yep. Come in here. I dare you to drop down. Coming? That's what I thought. Okay. Damn it. 
Don't like that. Don't like this. Don't like, don't like any of this. Don't. Ha, oh, hi, 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 ah, ah, hi, hi, go away. Hi, go away. No, 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 no. Don't like that. Please stop. Please stop. Okay. Goodbye. Okay. Don't like this. Uh, over? No, it's never over. <laughs> Hello. If there are any survivors out there, come to my to Louisa's house near the fields. Survivors? <laughs> Can I, can I, can I leave now? You gonna, you gonna get me? <sighs> oh, they busted that down. Well, that was nice. Oh. I hear gr There's what? There's one. There's two. Don't like this. You better. So help me. You better freaking frack stay up there. I'm not sure why my. Yeah, that's right. You, you back off. Now that. Not, not, my aim's doing a weird thing. Like if I'm over there. It'll automatically go over there. I, th I, mm. Listen. You better back the frick up. Oh, that was poor judgment. Oh, there's another one coming. Damn it. Survive the attack. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's great that you think I can do that. Oh, that one's got like a, a mace. Can I pick up the mace? Oh, there's a... I do not have the ammo to do this. This was... This was poor judgment. Oh. That was... This was a bad idea. Oh, I... Okay, got one. There's no end to them. Who wants a taste? Oh goodness. Nope. Are you freaking killing me? There's fire arrows. Oh, 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 oh. Mm-hmm. Okay. Come to Papa. Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? I'm absolutely not going down there. Oh. Full of flour. Great. That is right. That is right. Oh, I need to reload. Oh, no. I'm... Okay. Will you go down? Will you go down? Uh, no, 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 no. No, no, go away. Go away. Go away. Uh. Okay, crystal skull. And some. 
What in the frickin' frack is that? Okay. Oh, no, no, don't like that. Get out of here. What in the frickin' frack is that? Okay. 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 Hi. Okay. Okay. No 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 Go up the ladder. What? Oh okay, hi, hi. What in the What the frickin' heck is that? <laughs> oh, off the roof! Please give me some ammo, thank you. Oh. Whew. Whew. Oh. No, no, no. Okay. All right, right in the neck. Oh my frickin' gosh! Come on, come on, come on. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. You want some? You want some more? You want? You guys want some more? I'll take you all. <laughs> Okay! Uh, I just took a pickaxe to the chest! You're gonna finish it. That's right. Alright. Alright. Just, yep. Just, there you go. Just yank the old arrow leg. I'm dead. Oh, now. Okay. That guy is holding up another guy on a pike with one arm. That is impressive. And it is Santa. This is what happens to naughty girls and boys, by the way. Hi, buddy. Nice teeth. Oh. I'm going to say this once. But that was a scripted event, it seems like. Oof. Just dip it in the old parasite water. I'm trying to figure out where he had, like, clean gauze. Hi, th there's an old... There's an old lady? Okay. Mrs. Claus. Uh, I am a... I'm very put out that, uh, I wasted a bunch of ammo on that. If I had known that, uh, I'm, I'm getting a bunch of rusted scrap from somewhere. If I had known that that was a scripted event, I sure as heck wouldn't have wasted all my ammo on it. That would have been helpful if I had not been freaking the frickin' heck out. <sighs> Is there anything else up here that I missed? Any more bodies to loot from my Hulk out rampage that ended poorly? It doesn't look like it. But, you know, just jump down on a leg that you just got an arrow through. It's always helpful. I feel like, um, right now I'm safe. 
I'm not sure how much more safe I'll be because every more and more things seem to be catching on fire. But uh, I figure now is the time to uh, to explore. I don't. Of course, that's exactly when uh, the friggin' floor falls through, but, you know, I don't hear any ominous music. It seems relatively calm. I hear something. But I'm definitely going to get as much ammo as I can. I think the rusted scrap is from guys that I killed. I think. And I came from there. And this is where I came, this is where I came from. There's like a gate up there. I'm gonna check that out. Yeah, I hear your bells, old lady. I'll get to you. Can I get through here? It's locked. How dare you. All right. In life and in death, we give glory. Uh, hello? You shouldn't be out here. It's not safe. What the hell? <laughs> hey, can you hear me? Oh, it's you. Hey. The child's father. Child? Hey, wait. Do you mean Rose? Mrs. Is Claus. <laughs> Rose! Rose, yeah. She is in great danger. Really? Since Mother Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into darkness. What are you talking about? The monsters? The castle bell heralds danger. They're coming! <laughs> no. Wait. No, Where's wait. Rose? Who's I Mother can't Miranda? catch up to an the old lady. Tolls for us all. I'm just gonna They're let her close the gate, again. apparently. <laughs> Okay. Rose is here? Ethan, you absolutely could have kept the old lady from freaking closing that gate. Come on. What's in here? Anything good? Anything good? Anything easy to pick lock? Uh Okay. Cur search completed. Currently searching. So, I guess these are places that I've searched and have found all of the th the things. Apparently, I have not found all of the things in here. O oh, great lichens, the fabled monster wolves of old, may they come to eat our flesh, may they come to tear us apart. That seems like an absolute not great thing to want. Oh, don't mind if I do. I am going to... Oof. Don't like that. Okay. And I'm also going to do some crafting. There we go. And I'm going to craft some more of that. And I'm gonna craft some more of that. Oh, I don't have the gunpowder. Womp, womp. Okay. Well, she said they were coming again, and I don't see them. And I feel like... You know what? Stop gaslighting me, lady. Oh, well, I already did that. Okay, so where am I going? Ceremony site. 
Castle Dimitrescu. Can I go this way? Locked from the other side. Story of my life. Oh, and there's some gunpowder. Locked from the other side. Come on. And that's blocked. Um, that doesn't open. Need some kind of other item. Uh, oh, rusted scrap. Can I go in here? Doesn't look like it. So looks like I'm going up here. Right through the right through the graves. Can I shoot the the crows? Huh! I get a I get a achievement for that. Examine. We offer these goats of warding to protect the village and its people. Any who break them shall feel Mother Miranda's wrath. I feel like they are telling me to absolutely break these. Oh, you get money from animals. Well, that's nice. Uh, okay. Now, granted, Mother Miranda's wrath is like not something. Oh, I can't, I can't get in there. Mother Miranda's wrath is not something that like I'm, I'm looking for. At the same time, you don't give a guy like me collectibles to find, and then expect me not to not to go after him it's silly it's irresponsible uh, okay so this needs a thing find a way to open the castle gate guess this leads to the castle did that just open on its own what is up here My my exploration instinct tells me. Nope, can't go in there either. If a if a way opens for you, don't go in that way immediately. Never go in that way. Oh wow! I didn't realize I could do that. It's like a quick turn. Um. Yeah, don't go in the in the obvious. Mm. That just locked behind me. No, that's right. Uh, don't go the obvious way right off the bat because there's all sorts of hidden goody gumdrops everywhere. And generally, in especially in games like this, I find that uh, going the obvious way leads to cutscenes, and then you can't backtrack, and then you're host finding all of the goody gumdrops so I tend to not go the obvious way if I can avoid it I am gonna go into this house what's in here what is this <gasps> a save I'm gonna explore this place first and then I'll save and then I'll call it an episode um, but I made it I made it to the first save that's like way better than I thought that I would do. Maiden Crest. So that's something for the door um, that I need to open. Church. Should disaster fall upon the village, seek out the crests. One is in the care of the church, the other is at Louisa's house, which is where I'm trying to get to. Look at that. Alright. Oh. What was that? Can I shoot it? can shoot it. I got a thing. 
I got a yay. Yay thing. Okay. Uh, I'm going to call an episode there. Going to hit save. Um, if you like what you're seeing, hit like, hit subscribe. Uh, click the bell. Um, but yeah. This is... I, I, I feel like I am going through the transition from boy to man. I feel like I... You know, it's it's begun. I'm becoming less of a big bubble blowing baby. So, thanks for joining me, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Um, so, bye for now. <laughs>